good. Mm, yeah, I love these. <laughs> well, hey, everybody. Jeff Williams and Slim from <laughs> SJWilliams.com. Yeah, I know. <laughs> what are we doing today? But today, I got something special for all you viewers out there. That's right. But before we get started, I just want to say Happy New Year to all my viewers out there. Ain't that right, Slim? That's right. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I hope all you prospectors out there got something special from Santa, because I know I did, huh, Slim? That's right. Matter of fact, it's right here. I got one of Slim's original gold mine maps. Ain't that right, Slim? What? I know, I got it. Santa gave it to me. Woo, and this looks like one of the originals. Must be the granddaddy of all gold maps. Woo, come here, take a look at this. I want to show you this. Woo, look at this. It's the Lost Brave Fogel Mine. Ooh, that looks like Slim's ugly mug right there. <laughs> and look, I got one, two, three Lost Gold Mines. Ooh, I'm gonna have gold forever, look at that. There's all kinds of gold, I'm gonna be rich, Slim. I love this map. Ooh, this gotta be one of your better maps. But, but wait a minute, if I got Slim's map to a secret gold mine, what are you gonna do for gold? Don't you worry, chump, there's more where I came from. More? There's more? How the heck, so, you know, now that I think about it, how the heck does he find gold anyway? I've never actually seen him do it. How the heck do you find gold anyway, uh, Slim? I don't know. You don't, <laughs> you don't know? You gotta know. What the heck, Slim? You got some kind of secret or something? It's a secret. Ah, <laughs> I knew it was a secret. Actually, it's not a secret at all. I know how you get your gold. You go out dousing when nobody's looking, huh? I don't know what you're talking about. Ah, <laughs> I knew it. He's out dousing. Now, for you people out there that know what dousing is, that's where you use two metal rods. You find stuff in the ground all the time. People do it a lot. And I saw him doing it one night. He didn't even see me when I was looking at you, but I saw you. <laughs> I saw him. <laughs> Actually, dousing's been around for a long time. The Spanish used to do it way back in the day when they were looking for gold. I know you know that, Slim, huh? Anyway, what they would use is what was called a Spanish dipping needle. And then the prospectors of your time, they used to use what was called a miner's compass. You look that up. And basically the way it works is it finds magnetic fields in the ground, especially iron ore. And it points to it, and that's how you know that there might be gold there. But I'm going to show you how it's done, because I think I know how you've been doing it late at night when you think I'm asleep, don't you? <laughs> All right, so you know what I'm going to say, right? So come on, let's go. Yeah. Woo -hoo -hoo -hoo. Uh, Woo -hoo, there they are. I knew they were in here somewhere. <laughs> Woo, look at this. I got them. <laughs> I found your dousing rods. <laughs> Y'all bet you didn't think I'd find them in there, did you? <laughs> no, <I didn't. laughs> Woo -wee. Anyway, these are real simple. All they are is copper rods that are bent at a right angle. And all you got to do is hold them in your hand like this, huh, Slim? That's right. And then you walk out across the desert or wherever. And when they cross like that, whoo, you're on to something down in the ground. <laughs> now, I know it sounds crazy, but people have been using this stuff for years. Matter of fact, city workers use these all the time to find pipes down in the ground. You can look that one up, huh, Slim? That's right. <laughs> all right, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to have you go out and bury some stuff out there in the desert, and then I'm going to come out there and see what I can find. You don't mind if I borrow these, do you? I don't mind. Ah, I knew it. You probably haven't used them for a while anyway. <laughs> All right, so you know what I'm going to say, right? So come on, let's go. Hey, Slim. Could you have picked a harder place to try? Holy cow. You've been busy. Look at all these holes. Okay, so how's this going to work? Well, get out my dousing rods right here. Trusty, dusty dousing rods. And what you're going to do is... You just hold them in front of you at a right angle. See how I'm standing like this? Loosely, you don't want to hold on to them tight. Nice and loose so they can move back and forth. All right, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go over each one of these holes. I don't know where, what Slim put in there or what. So I'm just gonna walk over each one and see what happens. All right, here we go. Go over the first hole. I got nothing. All right, let's try the second one. I got nothing. All right, Slim, I know you put something out here. Nothing. Okay. Oh, oh, I got something here. Okay, I'll mark that one. All right, let's try this one. Nothing. Okay. Oh, 
got one there. Thanks, Liam. How many targets did you put down here anyway? Yep, see how those cross? Definitely one there. All right, let's try this one. Nope, got nothing there. Nothing there. Okay, let's try this. Oh. Okay, see how those rods just lock right in? All right, let's try it again. Just to make sure. See that? They just pop right in. All right, let's go try and see what's in the holes. Ooh. All right. Now, I know I got one here, right there. I got one right here. And I got one right here. Whew. Okay. Now, I'm gonna go over it again just to make sure. Yep. Let's see what we got. Ooh, look at that. <laughs> Woo, that's a gold bar. That's the biggest gold bar I ever did see in my life. Oh, yeah. Thanks, Slim. That's my gold bar. <laughs> Not anymore. <laughs> Ma, that's the biggest gold bar I ever did see. Look at that thing. Woo, wee, yeah. I'm holding on to that one. Yeah. Okay, let's go over here. Ah. All right. Woo, ah. What? A nail? What the heck is that, Slim? You trying to trick me? Oh, I hate it when he does that. All right, let's go over here. Ah. Woo, those rocks are hard on the old knees. Okay. Woo, look at that. A silver bar. Mwah, I got gold and silver. Woo, yeah, I'll be celebrating tonight. Thanks, Slim. I take those things back I said about them. Ooh. All right, so what we're gonna do, okay, so we're gonna head back to camp and we're gonna talk about what just happened. So you know what I'm gonna say, huh? So come on, let's go. Woo, -hoo -hoo. Woo -hoo -hoo. I told you I could do it. Hey, it's not too bad, huh, Slim? Not too bad for a greenhorn. Ah. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, look at that pretty gold bar, huh? That's my gold bar. <laughs> no, that's my gold bar. Woo wee, you know, Slim, I haven't heard about people using a pendulum on a map to find gold. No yep. way. You ever hear about that? No. Wow, can you imagine that? Map dowsing? No, oh. I can't imagine that, no. <laughs> yeah, I have to check it out, huh, Slim? Yeah. Woo wee, I tell you what. Well, we had some fun today, huh, Slim? Yeah, sure did. We got to do a little dowsing with the dowsing rods, and I got to find my gold bar. My gold bar. <laughs> And a silver bar, too. And, of course, a nail. Why would you put that nail out there, Slim? <laughs> ah, he's always trying to trick me. Woo, well, I hope you've enjoyed today's episode of dousing out here in the desert. Hi, huh, Slim? Ah. <laughs> if you enjoyed today's episode, please rate, share, and... Subscribe! That's right! Subscribe! You know, <laughs> and subscribe! Because we always want to know what you think about all this craziness out here. So until next time, this is Jeff Williams and Slam from AskJeffWilliams.com saying you're skeptic about dousing and you're not sure it really worked. I just pulled up a gold bar. My gold bar. And prove that it'll work. Take care, everybody. Mm -hmm.